What's up everyone? How you doing? So yes, it is Friday. I'm going to go to a shop in a town called March. We're going to be playing some League. I want to try and get some prize packs because we are on that hunt for that really difficult binder to put together for our Pokemon library. And it is the prize card. You can only get them in the prize packs given to you by the shop. So I'm going to be going to a league right now. And hopefully we'll see some awesome players. We'll play some games, make do some trading. Yeah, it's just going to be a bunch of laughs because that's what poker is all about. Bringing people together, having fun and enjoying themselves. However, I had a little bit of a problem because I do have a competitive deck that I built a little while ago. Roaring Moon EX. I then go to the deck. I go, I'm going to get ready for the um, league to bring a deck so I can play some games. However, I just realised it is rotation day today. And all of the letter E's are rotating out. Fusion Strike, that sort of stuff, which means that the heart of the deck is no longer viable and legal to play in a competitive scene. So I just spent half an hour working out where to go next with this. And it's been absolutely sweating to try and figure out what card I've got of what. Yes, we've got the Roaring Moon there. So we're going for the alternate version of the Roaring Moon. Where you've got the non-EX version, which is actually still pretty good. It's all about ancient. And I have three quarters of the deck being ancient already. I thought it would be nice and simple to put some cards together. And hopefully get some explorer's guidance. Explorer's Guidance in there, rather. And we're going to go have some fun. I'm hoping that I'll be able to do some video recording inside the store. If not, I'll let you know how it goes at the end. All right? So let's get to the shop, shall we? Hey, right, so we just got back from March. It is late, super late. The shop roleplay. First time going to the shop, I, I wanted to just talk to the owner, talk to the players that go there, and it's super cool. We do we did get some prize packs. We've got some series one, two, and three to open up, and I can't wait to do that. But now it is really late. I am knackered. So I'm gonna catch you in the morning. We got these prize packs for the event at the role play game shop in March. And we've got series one, three, and four here. Correct, as we are on the mission of collecting one of every English printed set um, to add to the Pokemon library, and this is an impossible binder to make. It's the only way of getting these packs is if you participate in the play program, which is going to a shop, playing in their leagues, getting some packs. That's the only way you can get them. It's Really, really nuts. We've got these to open up today. So we're going to open up these today. And we're going to go see what we get. And then um, we'll update the binders and see how far we are from completing the set. I can tell you now, wishing I had started this a little earlier. Not now. Because <laughs> it's going to be a nightmare to... To get all of these, I think, but it's good that we're actually going down to our local game shops and playing in the leagues, getting these packs. I can't really wait for that to happen. Right, cool. We've got your series four pack price pack here. Inside here, you do have a selecting select printing of cards, um, and the differences with these cards now have this play symbol on their um, art on the card. Um, to symbolize that they were a prize card. So, fingers crossed, we should hopefully get some decent cards out of these. We'll leave the best to last, which is your prize pack for a Series 1. Um, that's where the evolutions are, and that's what the wife is after at the moment. Well, we'll see. Cool. First pack. 
in here. We've only got these three to open up today. Um, I don't know if it's a pack trick. Um, but we'll see if we get any ultra rares or any hits or anything like that. So we've got Perlia. You can see here, look, there's your play symbol there. Defiance Band. Boss's Orders, that's a good hit. Good playable card. Oh, nice. We've got a... Dikey energy there with some swirls stamped and everything. Oh, nice! And a Hisuian Guja V Star. Very, very good hit here. And a, and a normal energy. You know what? We'll sleeve this and we'll. Ah, with sleeves! We'll sleeve. Whoop! We'll sleeve the. Like you. Nice. Series four. See, I'm not even certain of how to tell what series it's in. So I might have to you a bit of research in how do I tell that that's a series four full. Uh, we'll have to we'll have to figure it out. All right, series three. Got the Arceus. Yeah. Oh, I really do like opening up the sort of style of packs because. You don't know what you're going to get. There is an online list. And uh, I'll be using that to determine what cards is needed. Cards isn't. Still got damage pump. Cracker shoes. Ah, another good playable card. It's going, it's, it's going into my um, uh, structure deck that I've built for this um, event. Quite good. Reason why it's playable, you look at the top cards of your deck, you may put that card in your hand. If you don't, discard that card and draw a card. So I'll either get a card or I'll put something in the bin, which I want to, because I want to put ancient stuff in the bin. And draw a card. Oh another, another good card for some research. See these are all playable cards. Look at that. Oh what a f <laughs> hey! Talk about it. A hollow trick and shoes. Very nice. Ah, uh, nice. Wondering if you do get a foil energy in each of the packs. Pretty, pretty cool. Let's leave up these two. Oh, check and shoes is good. Um, obviously, this is going to be a mission and a half to complete. Um, probably end up trading for some of these as well. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll see where we go from that. This is the one. There is one prize pack. Leave us on and all that in here. So maybe we'll see that. Let's dig in, shall we? Got Melanie. Oof, right. Melanie. And the Vitality. Moltres. Valeria Moltres. Larry, Mr. Rhyme Hollow. After the peak hollow. Fire energy. Alright, so it looks like you don't get hollow energies in all of the packs. Didn't get a massive hit from that, but nonetheless, we do need all of these for the binders. Whoop. Uh, let's start the journey. Collect them all. Ooh. Mr. Ryan. They're suing good job. V-Star's great hit there. And two energies there is awesome as well. Which is amazing. That's all the packs we've got time for today. But there'll be more and more coming in the near future. Do keep an eye out for that. Um, yeah. I just... I just love cracking these special packs. Oops, come back here, Mr. Rhyme. He's escaping. Catch him. He will be put into the binder for the library. 
Anyway. With the Pokemon Library coming together, we are slowly putting more, more and more binders, more and more cards. We want to collect one of each of the English printing version of every card in the Pokemon history. And it's going to be a mission. Don't get me wrong. We're going to open up them on here. Majority. We're going to start that again. We're going to open the majority of up on here live on Twitch and post on YouTube. And hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll get some videos out to you quickly um daily maybe hopefully we'll go back to the daily videos but at the moment across the week um and any extras i really want to throw on there twitch is main the main the mainstream platform but i want to get the youtube going the youtube going so hit that like hit that subscribe button comment down below what your favorite card from your collection that you have is because i want to share this journey with you thanks for watching guys stay safe look after yourself see you next time